everyone I'm so glad that you guys are here watching today's video which as you guys could know is talking about the new easy glam bag of this month so I'm so so shocked because I did not take a sneak peek you know that you could see what you're getting or how um, little purse is gonna look like or anything I did not at all see it I said you know what I wanted to come and be surprised for what I got and stuff like that instead of me looking at it and be like oh, I already know what's coming so you know no I said no I want to be surprised and see if I like what I got and you know I can't complain I kind of I like the stuff that I got you know and um, for ten dollars you can't beat it if you go to other stores those same products are good more than ten dollars but this is beautiful I really really love it like guys look at this isn't that beautiful I just love the color it's so beautiful like I could put it on my purse it's like I think it's purple or color like Maui Maui you know but it's so beautiful and like with a paint color right here I mean like you can't beat that like this is so pretty like give it a thumbs up so guys so yeah that's the person that came and inside the Ipsy Glam Bag there was a social butterfly Ipsy April 2018 little card it always has something back so you can read it life is too short to skip all the fun stuff happening right now and that's true you know why wait tomorrow to do something fun do it now that you have this time so the other thing that I got was a banana setting powder it's like this and uh, just look at it and it's a medium just so you guys know it's like this you remove this and you got your your foundation and everything so the next thing was whip cleansing cream it's a whip polishing cleansing cream with truffle extract something like that so let's use it the other thing that I got was a detang oh, delectable miracle material ultra nourish hand cream something good to have always in your purse or when you're out to go in the car or something just to have you know hand cream you don't want to have your hands all rough and stuff like that the other thing which I was like I don't want to use it yet till I do a video and show you guys what I got um, I got one like two months ago one of like this is a um, it's a limited edition uh, starstruck eyeliner but it's a oh and there's a stamp oh I just noticed it has a stamp I don't know where to turn it look two stars that's pretty cool I still gotta get the hang of it so don't mind me And the other one is this beautiful. Let me put it right here, my white sweater right here. And I'm gonna just swatch it. Yes, I've seen this lately. Um, Nikita Dragon did, I think, like two or three times, like stamps on her um, bottom of her eye. And, like, they're so pretty. I didn't notice. I know it came. I was like, oh, I got another liquid liner. Like, but you know, has pencil. I'm so hyped. But I did not know it has stamp. And it's a star. So let me just look. It came out really nice here. But not right here. We gotta do it gently, though. Try to remove it right now, right? But anyways, yeah, so I got 
have that one. Beautiful. Last but not least, I also got a brush. So soft, so soft. And this one is Glamour Dolls. It's really, really pretty. Does not say a number or anything. so so fluffy so I really I like it um, this is like my third time I get a brush from you see which hey it's like getting something free um, because brushes lately are kind of expensive and I basically like buying my my brushes online so yeah um I had a um, a, an experience today. So today I was with the family. I went to um, to the mall, and um, I go inside the store Mac. So as you guys know, I am a budget freelance makeup artist. I like good quality makeup, but it doesn't, you know, rip your pockets. So if I have to buy something a little expensive, I would, but I try to avoid that because I'm a but I did record it, so I try to help people that can afford expensive makeup, what products, you know, out there from different companies because let me tell you, there's a whole bunch of makeup uh, products out there that not everybody knows. So I'm one of those people that likes, you know, um, finding those products and helping you guys what product works and what doesn't. And um, story short, I was helping. Um, cause I was helping a bride, um, which is, she's a family member and I did a video with her, her name is Elvia, um, cause she is getting married. So, um, you know, she was trying to find which foundation works with her and stuff like that. So, you know, I was working there with her and, you know, I had a lady coming in and she really liked it. My makeup, she said, you know, like, are you a professional makeup artist I really like the way your makeup looks and you know she did look surprised when I told her that um, I'm a budget makeup artist and, and I said I'm a youtuber and she, she you know she wanted to know what was my YouTube name and I told her and I was like well the foundation that I'm wearing is Milani she's like what what is that so I, you know I told her you can get a Walmart it's like ten dollars and it's two in one you know, she was really in shock, you know, of a unexpensive product could cover up, you know, um, good, you know, face and make it look really nice and it was well blended. And the, the thing here is that when you do makeup, you have to blend everything really, really well in your hairline, in the area of the neck. Just don't do the front and be like, okay, I'm done. No, you have to get all the way down your chin and the neck area and blend it out really nicely. You do not want to look too white. You do not want to look too dark. You just want to look correct. You just want to take a picture and do not look like a ghost or disappear in the light or like, I don't know, whatever you guys want to call it. You know, this here, babbling. Um, you get the picture. So, you know, I am here to answer any questions for you guys want to know what kind of foundations, concealers, stuff like that, that aren't in a budget, but you know, that you want to afford, but also want to look good and you want it to work, I am here. So you guys feel free to leave a comment down below. I also have a Snapchat, I also got a Twitter, and I also have an Instagram, which I am kind of constantly more on um, Instagram than Snapchat and Twitter, and I'll be posting products for hair, uh, for skins. Um, fashion stuff, uh, glasses, purses, um, hair product, or like anything to help people out, you know, and say, hey, buy this because it does work and I know it's going to work for you and it doesn't cost that much. So, yeah, people will say, oh, her YouTube videos look like she's doing it in her room. Yes, I do it in my room. And that's basically half of the makeup people that, um, 
that started from the bottom worked their way up. They didn't start it really fancy or anything like that. Jacqueline Hill had a background of a, of a refrigerator behind her, her apartment, you know, and little by little, look at her now. You know, we all start from the bottom up, you know, so, and I know that little by little, I will grow more, not also, not only as a freelance makeup artist, but also a YouTuber. So I appreciate you guys for the support and whoever watches my videos and keep you know watching them and cherish them. Thank you so much. It really really means a lot. Also guys, do not forget to go now. She opened up her webpage where she is selling her makeup products and other things. It's it's Beauty Vibes and she also has a big Facebook page in which it is on now. If you do not follow me on uh, Instagram, uh, if you do, you did see that I posted, I'm trying to find here um, the picture. You did saw that I posted a, um, uh, a photo of her, you know, kind of like the page and stuff. So I'm just going to put it right here so you guys could see it real quick. Let me just... That is her page. You could go on my Instagram or you could go at www.itsbeautyvibes with a v.com and go get yourself some stuff. And also, with a purchase of $20 or more, you get in a free um, lip scrub. So, hey, go check it out, guys. All right. And don't forget to give a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.